YouTubers. Um, today I'm going to unbox my Nerdy Puss for September. I got this a little while ago. Um, I just hadn't unboxed it yet because I was behind. I just did my August one, which is Shadow Hunters, and I got the ultimate one for um, Sarah J. Mass. And um, right now she has until the 30th uh, the dragon theme, which my daughter really wants. Um, so I might get just the regular one because they're out of the ultimates already. So I didn't have any money for the ultimate when she first announced it. So hopefully my daughter will just like the regular one. But anyway, here is what it looks like inside. Like I said, Shadow Hunters and Sarah J. Mass wins me over. <laughs> All right, we got a lot of floop. My son likes it and he's right here with me. So I'm going to give it to him. He's going to make a mess with it. Here you go. No, no, no. No, no, no. All right, the first thing I see is a candle. And it's from a quarter of candles. So let's look at this and smell it. This is pretty. And it's Adian. I hope I say these names right. I'm always, like the the Aquatar books, she had in the back how to pronounce everything, which was really helpful. Ooh, that's kind of like a clean scent. Here's what it looks like. And here's the label. Beautiful labels. They have beautiful labels there. So um, I'm sure that's part of the ultimate the candle is. You want to get by? Okay, the next thing I see, um, I had to get the shirt because I'm a big fan. And it says, don't let the hard days win. And it's got the Illyrian wings and then it's got the mountains and the three stars and don't let the hard days win. And it's purple, my favorite color. So love it, love it. All right, let's see what else is in here. Okay, the next thing I see is a Karanam All Natural Lip Balm. It smells really good, but it's got like a nice, clean look to it. And it's just like a little tin of lip balm. So that's pretty cool. By Book Balm. Uh, the next thing I see is the pen, and it is so pretty. It's a star ball. So that's so pretty. Okay, and next thing is, um, I think it might be a pillowcase or a bag or a tea towel. It is a pillowcase because it has a zipper on the bottom here. But it says, the world will be saved and remade by the dreamers. So... There it is. That's so pretty. That's all my favorite colors in it. Purples and blues and pinks. I'm sure this is part of the ultimate part too. And then um, you've got the one poster that's rolled up. These are always hard for me to get open. <laughs> Here comes my son. He always comes when I'm... he doesn't have school today. There you go. My other kids do. He's in preschool. Man, I can never get these open. It's the tape. And I don't want to ruin it. And some of the people that unbox these on Instagram, I don't know how, they must undo them off camera and then show it. Okay, I think I got it. It packed this up so good, but I can never get them open. Okay. Oh, this is pretty. And like with these, you have to like get something to hold it down so that, you know, you can put it in a frame or wherever you want to put it. Don't feel bad for one moment about doing what brings you joy. So, there's that. And I like that there's 
vines to symbolize the roses. That's really cool. Sorry it took me a while to open it. <laughs> I could still smell the candle in here, even though I took it out. All right. Business card for a book ball. Nerdy post postcard with the stag and then uh, the crown is usually on top, but yeah, that's pretty cool. It's a postcard. And then a sticker. We need hope or else we cannot endure. That's really pretty. And then we have a bookmark with Aileen and Rowan, which is pretty. And then on the back is uh, Reese and Feyre. It's kind of dark, but I love how they did her hair. And I love how uh, Reese is still all in black, but he has got a little bit of white on him. So that's really cool. I like that. And then here's um, a print that says she was fire and light and ash and amber and she bowed for no one and nothing. So there's that one. That one's really pretty. And then uh, this one's the spoiler card. I could survive well enough on my own given the proper reading material. So there's that. Here's the little foil print. Only you can decide what breaks you. And it's got like some foil there going on. And then um, I saw some, someone have one of these on a buy sell trade and this looks beautiful. These are postcards. And um, let me see what we got here. I like how they put this in a little plastic slip here. But is it And then visit Riftle, which that doesn't look as pretty. But when reading the books, it doesn't sound very pretty. Visit Valeris. Oh. Now there's where I'd want to visit. <laughs> and visit the Hewn City. I don't want to visit that either. <laughs> those are beautiful. I love those. So that's the end of the box. Let me get the spoiler card so I could give credit where credit is due. But mostly the nerdy post box is designed by the owner. And uh, she does such a great job. And right now she has a baby and she's still going strong. She did a great job on the Shadowhunters box and this one. So, there is my spoiler card. My son is coming all around me. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess they had another Sarah J. Mask box. I missed that one. Um, but they put this one together and she talks about balancing a newborn and completing the designs but she brought in some artists which some of them she gets other artists to do. The print, don't feel bad for one moment about doing what brings you joy. Um, bookmark side one is designer Dakota Black Art and then side two is also Dakota Black Art and that was the Aileen Rowan in Rescind and Fairy. And the mini print, um, reverse side of this, designer is Reverie and Dink. I could su survive well enough on my own if given the proper reading materials. Sticker, designer is Indigo 11. We need hope or else we cannot endure. And the postcard, we absolutely love seeing your colored in postcards, so be sure to tag us in your photos. And that's what would come in the uh, Nerdy Post light. So I think she said she's going to have some more of these Sarah J. Mass ones um, in the shop. But they'll be limited. Um, no more of the Ultimate. The Ultimate is done. But you could probably get the Post light and probably um, just the regular Nerdy Post. Um, and that includes the what I already said plus the mini print. She has Fire and Light. The lapel pin which is uh, by Drop and Give Me Nerdy. Um, card one is Obsidian Abnormal, Visit the Hewn City, and Visit Valeris. 
And they also did Visit Riftfold and Visit Teresian. The lip balm is creator is Book Balm, and it's Karen M. The ultimate nerdy post included all of the above and foil mini print, only you can decide what breaks you. The throw pillowcase, the world could be saved and remade by the dreamers. The mini creator, creator is Court of Candles, which is Adian. And the nerdy tees, which could be combined with either the nerdy post or the ultimate nerdy post, says don't let the hard days win. And um, Alexis is the designer. October theme is dragons. And yeah, my daughter wants that box, so um, they ran out of the ultimate, so she'll have to get just the regular nerdy posts with the T. But yeah, the dragon one looks really good if you want to get a dragon one. Um, if you're interested in some of her other past boxes of other past videos, um, I have some, but others have, you know, other ones. Sometimes she has those in her shop, and um, if there's another thing that you like, sometimes she has where you can build your own box, so you can pick certain um, bookmarks or postcards and build your own box. So that's really cool too. So check her out and um, I love this box. Uh, tell me what you think in the comments. Thank you for watching.